Tonight, friends, family, and fellow officers gathered to honor one of the 11 members of the Patton Village Police Department, Sergeant Stacy Baumgartner, killed Sunday in a crash that resulted from a police chase. Our Kathy Hernandez, live in Kingwood tonight, where a visitation service was just held for Sergeant Baumgartner. Kathy? Well, Bill, people are remembering Sergeant Baumgartner as a hardworking police officer and a man who loved his family. Family, friends, and fellow officers pay tribute to a fallen hero at the Kingwood Funeral Home Thursday night. One of the best uh, sergeants you'd ever want to meet. Helpful, kind, uh, not the typical sergeant. Investigators say Sergeant Stacy Bumgarner was chasing Garrett Knee Sunday night. They say Knee ran a red light and an SUV crashed into Bumgarner's patrol car at FM 1485 and State Highway 242. The 39-year-old officer and 11-year-old Adan Eladio, who was riding in the SUV, died. It hurts because he didn't have a reason to die. <laughs> there was no reason for him to go. As these families start the healing process, the small Patton Village Police Force does the same. The police department is dealing with this very hard. Even harder, knowing Sergeant Bumgarner was a family man who left behind a wife, 20-year-old son, and four-year-old daughter. Every morning, Facebook his children and his family, and they ask him why. He said, well, I may not come home today. And of course, they didn't understand that. And of course, Sunday he didn't come home. And Sergeant Bumgarner's funeral will be at the Woodlands Church, formerly Fellowship of the Woodlands, at 10 tomorrow morning. A burial will follow at Brookside Cemetery. Reporting live in Kingwood, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC, Channel 2 News. All right.